The Dunton Technical Center informally Ford Dunton or Dunton is a major automotive research and development facility located in Dunton Waylets, Langdon, Essex, United Kingdom owned and operated by Ford Motor Company. It was the largest automotive technical center in the United Kingdom and takes its name from the nearby Dunton Waylets. Ford Dunton houses the main design team of Ford of Europe alongside its Merkinich Technical Center in Cologne, Germany. In 2007, Dunton had around 3,000 staff working at the site. Location Ford Dunton is situated at the junction of West Main B148 and the A127 Southend Arterial Road, in Dunton Waylets in the district of Basildon. An electricity pylon line straddles the site. In front of the building, to the north, is a vehicle test track. To the south is the Southfields Business Park. The site lies in the religious parish of Landon with Dunton, formerly in Dunton and Bulvan before 1976. Dunton is a small hamlet to the west, with a former church near Dunton Hall. There is a Ford dealership on the B148 on the northwest corner of the site. History Construction Ford Dunton was constructed by George Wimpey for a contracted price of £6.5 million. The total cost of the centre was around £10 million. The centre originally had 45,000 square feet 4, square meters of space for design work, making it the largest engineering research centre in Europe. Another development site at Averley had been opened in 1956 which made prototype cars and spare parts, and closed in 2004. Ford's earlier UK design site was at Dagenham five start building, and it previously had seven engineering sites around the UK, with five in Essex, these all moved to Dunton. Ford Dunton was opened by Harold Wilson, then the British Prime Minister, on 12 October 1967. Topic. 1967–2000 At the time of its opening, Dunton was assigned responsibility within Ford of Europe for vehicle design, interior styling, chassis and body interior engineering, engine calibration and product planning. Ford's Merkinich Center in Cologne, Germany was given principal responsibility for body and electrical engineering, base engine design, advanced engine development, exterior styling, homologation, vehicle development, ride, handling, NVH, and transmission engineering. This was a systems approach to the engineering process intended to eliminate the duplication of engineering responsibility within Ford of Europe. In the late 1960s Dunton worked on an experimental electric car, first shown on 7 June 1967, and called the Ford Commuter. On 10 May 1971 Peter Walker opened a £1 million engine emissions laboratory at Dunton, the largest of its type in Europe. In November 1974 the world's first automated computerized multiple engine six test bed was constructed at Dunton, built in cooperation with the engineering department of Queen Mary, University of London. In 1974 a Honeywell 6050 computer was installed at Dunton at a cost of £820,000. The computer was linked to Merkinich and to the Ford test track at Lommel in Belgium. From 1978 Dunton had access to a CDC Cyber 176 computer at the USA base in Dearborn. By 1984 staff at Dunton were conducting video conferences with colleagues at Merkinich, using the ECS-1 satellite, and enabled by British Telecom International. In 1988 Dunton prepared the way for design of the Mondeo codename CDW27 by pioneering, in collaboration with Merkinich, the World Engineering Release System WERS. Dunton at this time was the most advanced automotive development center in Europe. In 1995 Dunton, in collaboration with the University of Southampton, developed a device which is capable of detecting different types of plastic for recycling using the triboelectric effect, including polypropylene, polyethylene, nylon and acrylonitrile butadiene styrene ABS. On 16 December 1997 Alexander Trotman, Baron Trotman opened a £128 million environmental engine testing facility at Dunton. Topic. 2000 to present In 2003 a Silicon Graphics International SGI Reality Center was constructed at Dunton, incorporating SGI Onyx 3000 visualization supercomputers, using the Infinite Reality 3 graphics rendering system. 
In March 2010 Ford announced plans to develop a new generation of environmentally friendly engines and vehicle technologies at Dunton following an announcement by the UK government that it would underwrite £360 million of a £450 million loan to Ford from the European Investment Bank. In July 2010 the new coalition government confirmed that it would honour the loan commitment, and the contract was signed in a ceremony at Dunton attended by the business minister Mark Prisk on 12 July. In recent years Dunton has been responsible for the development of the Econectic range of vehicles, and has contributed to development of the EcoBoost range of engines. <laughs> Activities Dunton houses the main design team of Ford of Europe, alongside its Merkinich Technical Center in Cologne. Currently Dunton has responsibility for the design of the Ford Fiesta, the Ford car, engines for Ford of Europe powertrain, commercial vehicles and the interior of Ford of Europe cars. It has facilities to simultaneously test 15 cars and around 100 engines. Around 3,000 engineers currently work at Dunton. Ford Dunton is also the home of Ford Team RS, and as part of the special vehicle engineering section of Ford created by Rod Mansfield, developed the XR family of hot hatch vehicles with the Ford Fiesta RS Turbo, more recently becoming the RS family of vehicles. Ford also notably worked in this area of design with Cosworth of Northampton. Notable staff Eamon Martin, 1993 London Marathon winner worked at Dunton. See also Whitley Plant, was previously owned by Ford, now Jaguar Land Rover. National Engineering Laboratory